What's up everyone? Thank you so much for joining me today. Uh, this is going to be a men's haul. If you don't know what a haul is, or in this case a men's haul, uh, stay with me. I'm going to explain what it is. If you like fashion though, I think you might like this video. Alright, with all of that said, let's go ahead and get started with this video. Thanks for staying with me. A couple of days ago, I went uh, to the store with my wife and uh, I was looking for a number of different things, but I had a focus on uh, men's shirts and I bought this shirt. Uh, I really like this shirt. It's a shirt by Jones, New York, uh, but there were a couple of other shirts uh, that I passed on and decided not to buy. Uh, and I really regretted it once I got home and tried this on. Uh, it feels great. I think it looks good. Uh, and so I went back uh, the day after, which was yesterday, uh, and I went to pick up those items. I ended up going to uh, both Marshalls uh, and Burlington, uh, where I bought this. And so this is a haul, a men's fashion haul or a men's haul uh, relating to the items that I bought. All right, so let me share what I got. But first, let's get into what is a haul? What is a men's haul? What do you mean? Do you know what the word haul means? But when I say men's haul, it might not have been as readily apparent. It is a popular type of video, haul videos uh, here on YouTube. So haul videos are those in which YouTubers show their audiences the various products that they have bought from one or more stores, where you'll have Marshall's haul, uh, you'll have uh, you know, TJ Maxx hauls, Ma Walmart hauls, uh, you know, Burlington hauls, Zara hauls, H&M hauls. I think you know what I mean. Uh, so this is a men's haul because uh, I bought a number of items and I'm going to share what those items are. These are men's products. And so that's why I called it a men's haul. And I wanted to take the time to just kind of go over that because I do intend to uh, start to uh, include more videos on my channel that relate to uh, you know, fashion and men's style in a more organized and consistent way. So that's why and I might uh, you know, title some of the videos uh, you know, fashion haul, or men's fashion haul, or style haul, or something along those lines. So with that out the way, let me go ahead and get the bags and let's just go through. It's not a very big haul, but it's just a few items and uh, I'm really excited about the things that I bought. Uh, so I want to share uh, that with you and maybe someone out there uh, that finds it interesting, informative, and uh, uh, and so with that said, let me turn to those items. All right, so I of course have these two bags. The little one is from Marshalls. There's one item in there. And this bigger bag, I have a few items from Burlington. I'm gonna start with the products that I bought from Burlington. So this is not going to be a big haul. Uh, there are not a lot of items here. Uh, really only five items. So this should be relatively quick. The first is a shirt. And this first shirt is a Jones New York shirt. Uh, it's a navy blue. I'll, I'll go over a little bit more. This won't be a review, but uh, so let me just put this down. Navy blue long sleeve button down uh, Jones New York dress shirt. And the second shirt is a checkered uh, blue and white. Was that gray with the, uh, I don't know if that's gray. It's a checkered blue shirt, blue and white. Uh, this is a Nautica shirt. And then I've got another Jones New York shirt. And this is a button down dress shirt and it's white. And the last two items are ties. I've got this blue tie. Uh, and this is by Countess Mara. And this red pattern tie. It's a Dockers tie. Those are the five items. So I really like the pattern on this and the colors. Uh, I love this skinny tie. I like the, the thin ties. 
And I bought this for $5.99. And I really like the pattern and the colors on this Countess Mara shirt. I bought this for $5.99. Uh, and this is uh, really, really nice. One of the things I just noticed pulling this out the bag, that this is not a slim fit, and I'm wearing slim fit uh, shirts now. Uh, this is a classic fit. Uh, uh, this has a stretchy type material, and it's uh, supposed to be uh, wrinkle free. I bought this for $12.99. This navy blue Jones New York shirt, uh, I bought for $14.99. Uh, and this is the same type of shirt as the one I'm wearing. Uh, this is slim fit. Uh, and again, this has a stretchy material. It has a stretchy material. It is wrinkle free. Uh, and I, I really like this shirt. Uh, the Nautica is slim fit as well. And I bought that for $16.99. Like the checkered design. And it too has somewhat of a yeah, it has a stretchy fit and I guess, yeah, and this is, I think, wrinkle free as well. And these shirts, uh, the, the Jones New York and this Nautica shirt, uh, they are moisture wicking as I understand it. Uh, very happy with the purchase. Again, this is not a review. I may uh, do another video in the future on one or more items that I'm showing you today. And now let me just turn to uh, the one item that I bought from Marshalls. Hold on, let me get it. And it is a bottle of cologne. It's called London. It's called London by English Laundry. And That was good. And this London by English Laundry cost $14.99 at Marshall's. I think I got a good deal. And I think that this bottle is absolutely beautiful. And again, I'm not going to do a review, just showing some of the items that I bought. I'm not doing a review of any of the items here today in this video, but I think, I, yeah, I'm fairly sure that I, I will most likely do a video on this uh, bottle of uh, men's cologne. I recently did one on another type of English laundry cologne called Signature, and that's uh, on the channel here. Uh, so check that video out if you haven't seen it already. All right, so those are all the items that I bought for this men's haul, and, uh, and yeah, that's it. I really appreciate each and every one of you who has watched this video. If you haven't already, go ahead, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. If you haven't done that, I'd appreciate it. With all of that said, have a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful day. Until next time, take care.